gonna meet you outside. I wouldn't keep him waiting. I want you to have a word with Emilio. Convince him to pay his dues to the Corleones. Think you know what to do? Sort of. How should I handle it? Yeah, it depends. With some guys, you only need to show a little respect. Just walk up to him and talk to him. A little negotiation goes a long way. Got it. And if the guy don't look like he's going to crack? Then you remind him why he needs protection in the first place. Try turning up the pressure, but don't go too far. A man pushed past his limits could be dangerous. Fish. You want to earn some protection money? First, you got to find a business right for the taking. To extort the owner, you got to convince him that it's in his interest to pay us. Capiche? Each merchant falls under different kinds of pressure, and everyone has a weak spot. Some folks will listen to reason. Others? Well... You're going to have to uh, apply pressure. When targeting a merchant, you'll see his pressure show up under his help. Everyone has two lines, where they'll give in and where they'll fight back. The closer you can push a merchant to their breaking point without pushing them over, the more cash you'll take home. But be careful. A man can only take so much. Push them too far and they'll snap. Maybe even take you on. Persuasion is an art. You can threaten the poor schmo with your bare fist or a gun. You can smash up his shop, even beat up some unlucky customers. All sorts of ways. Me? I like the simple approach. Crack open the register with his own head. Sometimes, though, you won't even have to break a sweat. If the shopkeeper asks for a favor, you might be able to win him over by doing what he asks. Earn his loyalty, you'll be rewarded in kind. Some business he wants to settle with you today. Why should I even give you a dime? End of discussion. Got it? Don't make me twist your arm. I'm Get your hands off me! Take your... No! Please! Not that! city you want to be the king you gotta control the rackets they're all over town usually in some crappy little shop with a dirty secret these shops are called fronts and they are hiding the illegal racket stuff that's being pushed on the streets break the shopkeeper and maybe he'll let you poke around his business if you're lucky you'll find the racket boss try cracking some skulls and persuade him to show the corleone some loyalty 
but it's better to buy him out instead, if you can afford it. The more rackets you control, the more cash you'll make for the family. But to be a real earner, you have to find the warehouse supplying the fronts. These fortresses are a tough nut to crack, but if you take one over, you'll discover where all the liquor, weapons, and other racket merchandise actually arrives in New York. The hubs. Taking over a hub is the key to breaking the rival family's back. There's another way to get your teeth into those rackets. Hijack their supply trucks first. Each neighborhood is full of trucks smuggling goods from warehouse to business and back. Stop the truck and take out the guards, then rough up the driver. Take his keys, stash the truck somewhere safe, and you'll score some fat loot. Finally, don't forget to check in on the local brothels and casinos. Those gamblers, pimps, and madams tend to stick together, but if you smooth talk the owner just right, you might find yourself sitting in the lap of luxury. Cheapskates. But I'll take what you've got. Maybe we'll see each other around sometime. It's the old Stanley kid. Make trouble, and the cops are gonna be all over you. The bigger the crime, the more heat that comes down on your head. The cops will be everywhere, and they won't be too friendly. That is, if they ain't already shooting. Manage your heat by bribing cops on the street or cooling your heels at a safe house. Each neighborhood is run by a police captain. Leave some problems with this guy, and he'll make sure all his lackeys look the other way if you want to wave your gun around. Hell, they might even fight for you, as long as you don't push things too far. If you join the family, you'll get Tom's report. All our guys report back to Tom and tell him the heat levels in each neighborhood. Keep an eye on the heat. You might get burned. Jeez, what took you so long? You get the money? Yeah. And you go. See, I told you this business was interesting, huh? I want you to meet up with a friend of mine, Paul Gatto. Show him this. That way he'll know you're a friend of mine. I gotta go. Thank God someone finally took down that fucking racket. You look like you want to talk to me? You must be the new guy I heard about. Interested in making a little money? Hey, sure. What can I do for you? There's a barber on Mott Street, protected by the Tatalias. Show him who runs this town and the place will be yours. You might even get a free haircut out of the deal. When you're done, talk to some of the other merchants you see. A good Corleone enforcer always starts out as a good earner. You understand? Get your grubby hands off of me. Yeah. 
Anyway, you're on your own. 